We are the Spirit of America Winter Percussion Ensemble, ages 10 to 21. Some of us have been playing drums for years, some of us have been playing clarinet and are learning drums for the first time. We're building our season towards Dayton, Ohio in April 2009, and this is our story. Hi, my name is Pete Shannon, and I'm 22 years old. I've been a member of the Spirit of America Winter Percussion Ensemble. For the past nine or ten years, uh, we used to do uh, shows and exhibition as a part of the Winter Percussion Circuit here in the Northeast. About six years ago, uh, we went out to San Diego and competed for our first time, placed second. This past year, there was a team of four of us uh, to design our upcoming show for the 2009 season. Uh, we got together a couple months ago and discussed everything from bees to Shrek to the galaxy, everything we could think of. And we ended up settling on one word to describe a show. The word we decided on is momentum. And it's this X factor that no one can really describe what makes momentum or how people all of a sudden get it. So we have our buzzword and we have our concept. What do we do next? Well, we thought the only way to show what we want to show with drums and movement is to come up with a storyline. Well, we start at what feels like the beginning of a day. It's quiet, uh, the floor is still. Sounds begin to wake the members of the floor, more and more movement. But there's really this sense of you need to be self-motivated to start a day. Momentum just doesn't happen like that. So there's this sense of more and more movement, more and more interaction player to player, interaction section to section. Uh, what ends up happening though is this momentum gets a little personalized. It gets a little individual, a little selfish. The momentum gets totally out of control to the point of chaos. It's like the basketball team that's trying to be a little too fancy and thrown behind the back out of bounds or just that feeling that like things aren't quite clicking. So there's this point of chaos early on in the show. Everything falls apart and we start to build it up again. We start to, uh, to, to lean on each other, lean on each section, uh, player to player, uh, the sound of each section, and it's building up again. And we start to use momentum in the right way, build it to the end of the show, and end it strong. And the first thing we wanted to do was get a floor design. One girl had a picture of the inside of a marble. It was this glass kind of frozen in place with this ball in the center, and then this curling shapes and forms all around it. Hi, my name is Stephanie. Um, I aged out of winter percussion this year, and but I've been in it for about three years. The first year I was on marimba and dancing, and then the second year I was doing bass drum, second and third year. Um, and I'm on the design team this year. Uh, definitely was working on the floor design. And um, our idea with the floor design was basically a lot of movement, a lot of motion, fluidity, um, kind of going with the circular theme because uh, we kind of explore a little bit how once you get on the momentum train yourself, it doesn't quite work. Once you get everyone on it, that's where uh, things get done. That's where um, a lot happens when you are united in the momentum. And um, we sort of get that kind of build up into the center, into kind of the united circle. And we also went with the very like natural look, pa painted look, um, hand done. Um, they actually had me do my signature because it's very unique, very uh, has a lot of character, and everybody that contributes to the momentum in a group has something to add, has their own character to add. But uh, it all leads to something really great in the end. Today is September first. We have eight months till we're out on the floor in Dayton. Where are we now? Well, we have our floor in a digital file that's ready to be sent off to be screen printed. We have three girls gathering materials for our costumes, and those will go into production. And we have 25 kids working out in tech camps, working on new technique, uh, working on changing from bass drum to snare, or learning percussion for the first time. So there's a definite feeling of excitement for the season. There's a feeling of growing momentum and we hope to really build that right up to Dayton and I hope to see you there.